Our dogs yearn to communicate with us, but it's sometimes hard to tell what exactly they are telling us. After all, a yawn does not always mean they're sleepy, and different tail wags can express completely opposite emotions. In this video, we'll try to decode every ear twitch, eye shift, and posture stance. Before we dive in though, be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our doggy-loving community. Alertness or Aggression Sometimes only very subtle cues can tell us if our dogs are simply watchful or are moments away from an attack. Imagine you're having a relaxed walk with your favorite companion, but in the blink of an eye, your dog suddenly goes statue still. Their ears perk up, and they're perusing the landscape with an intense, highly focused stare. Combined with a tail straight out, this suggests your dog is highly alert and assessing a potential threat. This is their processing mode. They are focused on something and might be deciding whether to approach or retreat from whatever has caught their attention. If their tail goes from straight to high and stiff, this might be a sign of excitement or intense interest, like their version of standing on tiptoes about some new object or small animal they noticed. If it's another doggo they're facing and their tail is trembling, almost like it's vibrating, this can indicate a mix of excitement and uncertainty. Or you might observe slightly broader stiff wags, as if they're waving a flag of personal power. I'm the boss here. Watch out for the sure signs of their warrior mode, like raised hackles on the back of their neck. And here's a pro tip. Do a quick assessment of the signals you yourself are showing. In anticipation of a possible confrontation, you might be tensing up your own muscles or giving commands to your dog in a tense voice. All this might fuel your dog's tension and ignite their readiness to protect you. Start by relaxing your own stance first, and then distract your dog with a calm voice or a favorite toy. If that doesn't work, take your dog slightly to the side and calmly wait for their perceived competitor to pass you by. White Flag Behavior If in reaction to your dog's dominant stance, another dog does a tail wag that is slow, reluctant, and only half raised, it could be a sign of a submissive behavior. Especially if combined with a lowered gaze, ears pressed back, or even lying down and exposing their belly. This isn't just a cute pose. The dog is saying, I'm not a threat. They might even loll their tongue or lick their nose as a peace offering. Curiously, submissive behaviors are often mistaken for guilt, especially when dogs lower their gaze or look away. However, studies have shown that this is more about acknowledging a social hierarchy than feeling guilty about that chewed-up shoe. Researchers once conducted an experiment where dogs were scolded for a mess they didn't make. The dogs often showed submissive behaviors, not because they felt guilty, but because they were responding to their owner's tone and body language. Signs of Contentment Perhaps the most heartwarming to us humans is when our furry pals are at their happiest. One sure sign of their pure, unrestricted joy is that delightful wag that seems to drag their hips left and right. As for the rest of their tail movements, they are far more nuanced than that. The real meaning of a tail wag depends on how quick it is, how broad the movements are, and how high your doggo is holding their tail. A broad tail wag, combined with a relaxed mouth and soft eyes, is the epitome of a happy, relaxed dog. Some dogs will show this behavior when they recognize a person or dog they are particularly fond of. They might even express this joy with a unique smile, pulling back their lips in sheer happiness. A slightly different meaning may be carried by a lowered tail that is wagging fast, with an open mouth but eyes alert. This still means your dog is excited and playful, yet at the same time, uncertain. They're basically waiting for instructions, like a furry soldier at ease. Use this receptive mood as a perfect opportunity for training and bonding with your buddy. And here's a fun fact. If, while seeming alert, your dog happens to yawn, they might not be signaling sleepiness at all. It can occur when they're focusing intently on something, like during training sessions. Also, your doggo might give that jaw-stretching yawn when they're expecting something exciting to happen, like before a walk or mealtime. But here's a totally different story. Imagine your dog, tail between its legs, ears flattened. Their body is almost scraping the ground, and their eyes are looking anywhere but at you. Your doggo will use this body language when they're trying to appear small and non-threatening, 
almost as if they wish they disappeared. You may also observe your dog yawning. Some studies indicate that dogs do this to calm themselves down in tense situations. If accompanied by a soft whine, this body language might be your dog's best attempt at submission, trying to disappear into the background and signaling a strong desire to avoid any trouble. Not surprisingly, this behavior is also an ultimate display of fear and often surfaces during thunderstorms. But here's an interesting twist. Dogs often tuck their tails during thunderstorms, not just because of the loud noises. Research has shown this may be caused by the static electricity buildup in their fur. Some dogs might even seek out grounded spaces to relieve this discomfort. If your doggo is stressed during fireworks, create a safe zone where your doggo would not feel exposed. Tuck them in with soft blankets and play white noise or soft music. If you're wondering which genres work best, researchers from the Queen's College in Belfast found that shelter dogs spent more time resting and less time barking in response to classical music. A different and quite shocking study by the University of Glasgow discovered that dogs may actually prefer reggae and soft rock. Whatever of these genres you choose, you'll find that music designed to calm dogs is slowed up to 60 beats, which has been shown to slow down their heart rate. With that said, watch out for a constantly tucked tail as it can indicate a health issue. Dogs with chronic pain or discomfort, such as arthritis or an injury, might keep their tails lowered to alleviate the pain. The Bow of Play Did you ever notice your dog lowering its front end while its back end perks up? If during such bow, their tail is wagging excitedly and ears are relaxed, it's the doggy equivalent of, tag, you're it. This gesture is an open invitation to play, a universal sign in the dog world that says, let's have some fun together. Interestingly, dogs don't just use this move with other dogs, they'll try it on humans too, sometimes adding a playful bark for extra measure. And here's another fact that not many dog owners know. Dogs that have been socialized well from a young age tend to have more pronounced and varied tail wagging patterns during greetings. This suggests that just like for humans, social experiences can shape how dogs communicate. Reading different tail types. While the tail is the most expressive body part of our furry friends, sometimes it may be surprisingly hard to read. Greyhound, Dachshund, or Shih Tzu have a naturally low hanging tail so they will show their excitement or fear in a different way compared to a high-tailed dog like a beagle or a curled-tailed dog like Akita, Husky, and Pomeranian. The rule of thumb is to note your buddy's average tail position in their relaxed state and then measure their tail's highs and lows based on this original position. And get this, some research has shown that dogs with short, stubby, curly tails are twice as likely to have aggressive encounters as those with longer tails. This is because their tail movements are so much harder to read, leading to misunderstandings among canines. Your dog's sleeping position can actually tell a lot about their mood. What position shows that your dog trusts and loves you? And can you tell at a glance if they are anxious? Check out this video where we discuss the hidden meaning behind your doggo's sleeping position. And be sure to subscribe to our channel and join our doggy-loving community 